These are some of the wildest moments in the history of snooker. Starting at number 15, Chris Wakelin's aim goes awry as he accidentally pots the cue ball. A miscalculation he certainly didn't intend. And a miss. <laughs> Looking for the thin Didn't edge, but uh, missing it altogether. And... Green pocket. I can only imagine he was going for the. He can't have been going for the the part surely. Moving on to number fourteen, Anthony McGill's humorous attempt to climb the table for a shot breaks the tension, reminding everyone that a foot must remain on the ground. I'm <laughs> Yes, you have to keep a, a foot on the floor at all times. Can't do that. <laughs> I don't think Marco is particularly amused. Make it feel even worse seeing his opponents having great fun out there. Advancing to number 13, Mark Williams astonishes with an off the rail escape. It was an, it's an unbelievable, no wonder Jimmy Robertson was sitting in his chair shaking his head. Devastated. He wasn't even yeah. looking at the... Well, no, he, he did a bit of Jordan Spieth there, didn't even look at the hole, you know, he just looked at the hole and... <laughs> it's well, extraordinary, was wasn't it? Incredible. You should, I mean, it was a good shot just to hit the green from there, but yeah. the potter, get the flick on the brown and uh, win the frame for I mean, just look look at this, I mean, it's just, he's not even looking. He's not even uh, looking at the cue ball, look at that. He's flicked the green, he's flicked the brown. Approaching number 12. Ronnie O'Sullivan humorously teases referee Olivier Martel, insisting on a specific cue ball placement after a missed shot, sparking a light-hearted dispute. Yeah. Can, I, can I just check? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's a bug, I think. Next up at number 11. Gary Wilson surprises everyone with a one-handed rest shot, demonstrating skill and precision to the awe of the audience. Spider, this green will be so difficult. We're going to hold it up with one hand. Well, this is a shot. Yes! Well, what a session that turned out to be. We had one long drawn out frame. But... On to number 10. Ding Young Wee's missed black after potting a red costs him dearly. A £30,000 mistake. Come on, get in, black. Moving to number 9. Graham Dot brings laughter to the snooker table with his comedic antics. Lightening the mood for both audience and commentators with his unique gesture. <laughs> I think he frightened everyone in the Crucible Theatre there. <laughs> Blue ball. Heading to number eight, Louis Heathcote executes an extraordinary shot in his World Championship qualifier using the jaw of the pocket to pot the yellow. Before we move on, please be sure to subscribe to our channel. Advancing to number seven, a missed call by referee Monica Sokowska during Mark Selby's match against Sam Craigie leads to a confusion over a non-foul. Yeah, he hit it well. He, listen, he's... Onward to number six. Neil Robertson's cue ball flies off the table in a surprising mishap, turning a serious shot into a moment of humour. Sometimes when you play a shot like that, you can just chip it. Trying to put so much power in it. And, uh, didn't cue that well. Proceeding to number five. In a 66 to 66 tie, Ronnie O'Sullivan secures a frame against Judd Trump with a remarkable fluke on the last black. Frame to win. He's played up. There's a chance of Ronnie to get this black all the way around the angles of the ball cushion. Next 
Instant number four. Cao Yu Peng's all or nothing miss on the final black against Mark Selby turns a dramatic match into a memorable victory for Selby. It was all or nothing. He has given so much the souls over the line in what has been a classic here in Seven. Belfast. Another. Moving number two, a pigeon intrudes on the match between Selby and Bingato, adding an unexpected guest to the list of snooker interruptions. <laughs> Please. Have you ever seen that like this? Where's the pigeon going? <laughs> Catch the pigeon. Oh, that wasn't a great thrust there from the, the air. <laughs> Go to the dressing room. <laughs> Finally, let us know what we missed. For more snooker content, click on the screen right now.